Libyan authorities say they will be increasing oil production as they target more international oil companies to invest in the country. This comes at the time when the Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries, OPEC, is struggling to contain a drop in crude prices and has been deepening production cuts. The chairman of the Libyan National Oil Corporation, Farahad Benegdara, announced that Libya will be seeking to reach a crude production of 2 million barrels by the end of 2025. That plan is way more ambitious than what he announced earlier in the year of reaching 1.5 million barrels within three years. We have untapped oil fields that were discovered two decades ago and are currently shut down. We have a huge reserve of natural gas. However, we lack the capability to produce more oil. There's a potential to reach 3 million barrels a day or even more, but national companies cannot do this job on their own. To expand Libya's oil production by nearly doubling the current volume of about 1.1 million barrels a day, Benegdara will be relying on international oil companies. But to seduce these oil giants to operate with full capacity in Libya, experts say the state-run oil corporation will have to offer more to reach this target. Most of these companies need security and guarantees for their operation that is missing in Libya because there is an ongoing political crisis. All international oil companies want to come to Libya. The country is still rich in untapped explorations. It has the eighth largest oil reserves in the world. A political solution for Libya's conflict can make the country dictate its demands for these companies to come instead of rushing to comply with theirs. Libya has the largest oil reserves in Africa but has been hit by years-long civil conflict and frequent closure of oil fields by protesters. The National Oil Corporation says it will drill 121 new wells to explore for oil and gas this year. Meanwhile, the government will also carry out maintenance on more than 1,300 wells to maintain its current production capacity. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo.